Hunter. Oklahoma going to have to slow down that high-powered rushing attack to be able to have a chance to pull off an upset at home. Michael Van Buren, true freshman quarterback in the game now. We'll get the update on Blake Shapin here in a moment. Is that one just a bit outside? Incomplete. Let's check in with Tex the rest of this game, but they've got Texas on the road next week. Here's Booth. Picking up a bucket uh, they have is Chris Parson, who started a game last year, but they're going to Van Buren here. And they get a first down with Booth. At some point, though, you got to start throwing. Van Buren, you know, just very raw. Van Buren throwing deep here, and it's incomplete. Trying for Mario Craver. They got to keep it on the ground. Johnny Daniels, good run. Close to a first down. One point's not going to be enough anyway, but they also early on struggled with some negative plays and some penalties that got him off schedule. Daniel not worth it. Down 21. Van Buren throwing. And that was a good ball. Caught by Akari down to the 32-yard line. An excellent defensive back playing off, giving some cushion to Akari and a strike. Thrown for a first down. And a gain of 16. Confidence there, Dave. Van Buren stepping up here, looking to run in trouble. And dives forward, got back to the line of scrimmage. He said, look, he, he's got loyalty to his players. He's going to prepare them, get them ready, and he wants to put them in position to have success. And look, he hears the noise. He, he knows what's being said. He knows. One at South Carolina. Down goes the quarterback, Michael Van Buren. He did get back to the line of scrimmage. Cashing in on the season. No one's looking to transfer based on what Mertz told us yesterday. And it will be interesting to see. You know, just offer some, some mentorship and guidance to the rest of the football team. What did he tell us after a slow start at Wisconsin? They ripped off seven games in a row. So I think the big thing, not just the coaching staff, but these players, this football team, staying together, staying invested, or the guy like... This is big time for Van Buren, who... Down to the five and into the end zone is Johnny Daniels for the Mississippi State touchdown. Not done yet. Not done yet. You get a win, you get some confidence. And here's the one thing that I think you feel good about if you're a Gators fan. You had a good quarterback. And more than likely, you've got multiple good quarterbacks. Wilson back. But starting corner, Jakeem Jackson. He's out with an injury. That pass is caught at the 30-yard line by Triore. Van Buren with a hitch and a completion. Mosley had a great touchdown catch earlier in the game. Turning to this game due to injury. Don't know what his status will be for the game at Texas. Van Buren from the pocket. Now forced out. Throws complete. Coming back to the ball is Craver. He's tacked. Future is going to get much, much more difficult. Ron Roberts is going to have to go back to the drawing board and get this defense fixed. Van Buren taking a shot receiver may have stepped out of bounds. It's incomplete. At some point, do you have to decide on a quarterback? Because as we've seen throughout history of football, the two quarterback system rarely works. So fast, but my friend. That's but different. That is, I agree. It is different. And I, I, I'm with you. Look, I. Here's Van Buren taking off. At the time when they used Tebow, yeah, I, it was it was different. It was. Sure. Somewhat status quo moving forward, but I agree. I think Graham Mertz, he's earned the opportunity to be on the field. He's going to give your team. But it does appear like Billy Napier is pretty set on making sure Lagway is getting reps during the game. There's a sack by Aaron. I, I think for Florida fans wondering what the future holds, I think it's going to be a combination of both Mertz and Lagway. How about that? On fourth down and 15. Let's take a look at the true freshman's nice throw. Fourth and super long. Steps into a nice throw. Creed Whittemore working on the sidelines. Because of uh, what we don't know regarding the future, Blake Shapin, that was an excellent throw. He tried to change the arm angle and check it. Van Buren throws complete inside the 20-yard line. Akari breaks a tackle. It'll be first and goal. They'll uh, field again. Job by Akari working back to that football. Ball is knocked away, but a flag with five seconds left in the game. 
Titans left first and goal from the two. No timeouts left. They did not get in the end zone and the game is over. Van Buren stopped short.